Were we, were we together when this happened? What's good, C&E squad? It's your boy Cameron. And your girl Eden. And we are back with another video. Yes. Look guys, today we're gonna be doing Never Have I Ever Part Two. Since last time we tried, it got a little smelly, so we didn't actually get to do it. <laughs> and the last time we did it, you guys requested that you guys actually wanted to see a part two. So we're doing a part two, but this time we let you guys choose what we're gonna do, like as far as the yeah. questions go. Minute, sorry. So sorry if you didn't get to like comment what you wanted us to ever have ever, but we'll probably do it again at some point so you can comment. There. Pay attention to our community tab whenever we do videos like this where we want you guys to participate. The whole squad, we would love it if the whole squad commented down below and participated in these videos. That'd be a lot of questions. Yeah, so so make sure you pay attention to our community tab. Make sure you turn your post notification bell on so you guys don't miss another upload of ours. But if you guys are new to the channel, before we get started, click that subscribe button, hit that post notification bell, because we post every single day. And smash the like button for us. All right, well, let's get it, because we found out some interesting things last time. Uh, now I need to throw in some bonus questions of my own. That I need so, to know. Some bonus questions? Some bonus questions. All right, so we're going to go ahead and start with question number one, y'all. Never have I ever drunk text an ex. Were we, were we together when this happened? <laughs> no, we weren't together. What in the world? No, we wasn't together. I don't talk to any exes right now, but everybody's had that weak moment. You don't have any exes, though. Well, I've just texted, like, guys that I probably shouldn't text. But, like, he wasn't What ex. guys you talking about? Before. And what, is that, what does that even mean? What do you mean? Like, what does that even mean? You drunk text a guy. It's different when you drunk texting the ex. I wasn't like drunk texting an ex to go like over and see them in the middle of the night. I was drunk texting an ex because it's like, you know, you get emotional when you're drinking and stuff like that. But what are you talking about doing? No, I mean like texting a guy that you like probably shouldn't text because like he's not good for uh, uh, you. Oh, okay. okay. Shut up. <laughs> Whatever. No, I'm, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Yeah, I, I drunk text an ex. And uh, I mean, they typically respond back to me, right? Because everybody, everybody loved me. Everybody, I told you, I told you that. What do you mean they everybody loved me. All my exes want me back. They wanted okay. me back. Well, my guys respond to me too. My exes, hey, I was the best in ever they will ever what have. Does that even, what do you mean your exes want you back? They, they want you me want back. your you exes I'm back? I'm just that guy. I didn't say I did. I said they do. Who does that? Who brags about their exes? I, I'm back? just saying. I'm a wanted guy. I'm, I'm America's most wanted. I'm just saying. We could argue the rest of the video, <laughs> but we're going to move on. <laughs> Never have I ever fainted. Fainted. I have not. I have not. I've been knocked out, but I haven't fainted. I've been knocked out. What, what's your, when did you get knocked out? When I was little, um, you know when you stand up and you get lightheaded and you just like completely like fall out? So uh -huh. I was in the bathtub and I stood up too fast and I got dizzy and so I fell back and I hit my head and I was out. But I woke up and I was like really out of breath and I didn't remember what happened to me and my head hurt and it was That's crazy. It was confusing. That's crazy. You remember when I got knocked out, right? Oh God. <laughs> You don't remember? Bad okay, I'll go ahead and start it. Let's see if you can finish it. Okay. So I got knocked out when I was playing 21 basketball. I was playing with like, probably like 20 people. We were playing on a blacktop. We were playing on a six foot rim. So everybody's slamming that thing. Wait, wait, okay. So you went up and you slammed it and you fell back and hit your head, right? Boom! Right? Yeah, somebody uh, undercut <laughs> me and I fell back and hit my head. When I came to, I was in the principal's office and my mother was actually there with me picking me up. So, yeah, I was knocked out for, for a little bit. I was knocked out for a little bit, so. Goodness, that's a long story. Not a fun story. I will never play 21 on a blacktop on a six foot rim ever again. You live, you learn. Yes. Have you ever been arrested? They trying to get into it. I have. I have not because I'm an angel. I, I, I've been arrested, but how many times? Now, I, I, I've, I've definitely been arrested. I've been arrested for uh, something I didn't do. Somebody was trying to jump me, basically. A whole crowd of people was trying to jump me. You know, I'm over there like, what's up? What's good, man? So basically, I told the dude, hey, you cross that line. Told the whole crew, if you cross that line, yo, is mine. You know what I'm saying? I was just like that. And I'm just like, man, come on. Come on. And back then, I was ripped and big. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, they was talking all that, talking, talking all that mess. Of course, I ain't going to run. 
up on you when you got like 10 people on you or whatnot. So, you know what I mean? No, everybody was afraid to, because whoever stepped up was going to, hey, lights out. They was going to get knocked. It lights out. At least that one person was going to get knocked out. My buddy ended up literally breaking somebody's jaw that night. Somebody inside that crew, he ended up like somebody came at him, bop, 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 and he was like, boom, broke his whole jaw out. Whole jaw was broken. Uh, me, I ended up just getting beat up by the cops uh, for doing nothing, and then tased not once, not twice, but three times that night. He was a big dude. Even even when they handcuffed me, I like I, I cooperated, hands up, everything, went down on my knees and everything, and hey, that's a story for another day. But I'm just saying. Police brutality is a thing, and they don't like this color skin. I'm just saying. I'm, I'm just saying. We get discriminated against. It does. Never have I ever forded and pretended it wasn't me. <laughs> I have. I kind of do I that have. all the time. You do it all the time. I'm just time. saying, every time the dogs fart, it's not always the dog farting. That's all I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? It be some of those ones that you just like scared. You scared to like let the other person know like that was me because they're going to be like, what the heck is going on in your body? And sometimes, they honestly, I blame Nala too. Hey, I'll be knowing though. I'll be, I, I be knowing. I promise I'll be he knowing. He does not be knowing. I'll I be knowing. Even, I don't blame Nala that much, but sometimes he'll make did Nala fart. And I was like, yeah, definitely. Yo stuff be. Yo stuff be. Whatever. <laughs> never have I ever eaten each other's snacks and acted like I never knew about it. Nah, I eat his snacks and I own up to it. What do you mean you have? I have, you know what I'm saying? I'm just saying. When, hey, when one of them cakes go missing, it's not always, I don't know what happened to it, how many did you have? What? I always know the number that I ate. You always know the number that you I ate? I always know the number no, that I, I ate. I can tell if like, I don't know, I have like maybe one, maybe two, like you must have One, eight. two, maybe five. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? You leave I, I, Look, 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 look. It, it's kind of like I that scene from Blue Street. I don't know the rest of them would. This guy. It's like Martin Lawrence. You leave snacks around me. I get the chomping. I eat them things. That is so true. I can't have anything good around him because he literally can't control himself around like sweets. Like <laughs> it's like that. It's a no-no. But I haven't. I own up to it. I eat your stuff and mm -hmm. I have no shame. <laughs> Never have I ever worn the same underwear twice. I'm gonna go like I have and I have not. That is nasty. No, it's a, no, no, no. No, I, I mean, I look, 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 look. I'm gonna go ahead and say I have, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this out here. But I'm gonna put this out here. There are double standards with certain things. That is just like an unwritten rule. Like a guy can wear the same drawers that twice. That is true, cause you know, it's different. Like, you know, in that area for like women versus for guys. But I haven't actually like put on the same underwear twice. I've just like gone to like, I've you know, worn the underwear all day. I fell asleep in the underwear. I wake up, it's like a Saturday. I don't change the underwear. So I'm like still wearing the underwear, but I don't like take off the underwear. And then I'm like, oh, like what am I gonna wear for underwear today? Likely excuse. And then I like put on. She, 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 she's <laughs> going through all this cause she's trying to make herself, she put, that's nasty. No, it's na it's I, truth and fact is it's nasty. But it's still not a full like 48 hours. It like goes to like- Honestly, I don't even wanna, did you change your drawers today? What do you mean? Did you change your drawers today? I, I just wanna know. I always change my drawers. Okay, you better have it. Nasty. Never have I ever led someone on when you weren't interested. I have not. I am beyond truthful. Like literally I'm beyond truthful. I you know like, what I'm saying? I like, I have, but like I didn't really mean to. Hmm? Like. <laughs> How you have and didn't really mean to? I what do you mean? I didn't mean to because like, because we were just like hanging out, you know, and I like, when it got to the point where like I saw that like he How wanted it work? to be like more serious than I wanted it to be, I like I didn't want to tell him. So, so you I, let him in. You let him on. No, I didn't like lead him on. I just didn't like flat out. To, I just like started like backing away like subtly, but I I didn't come subtly. out. Subtly. I didn't come. No, out. you gotta cut that junk out right then and there. Right like, there is done. I, I don't like. It's done right then and there. I don't like sudden movement. <laughs> I, hey, you know how honest I am. You know, on our first date, all right, I'll let you know. Yeah. But look, I'm really, really brutally honest, as y'all can already he see. Really is. He's I'm honest. brutally honest. And you know, if I, I, like, if I don't really, if I'm just hanging out with you, look, I'm letting you know. I, I'm just hanging out with you. 
I don't want nothing else. I, I don't want no relationship or nothing like that. So don't bring me into any of that. And if you start acting a little bit funny, like you trying to get with this, then uh, yeah, um, I'm probably not gonna pick up the call, but I'm not gonna avoid you. If you really wanna know the answer, I'm gonna let you know. Get lost. Like us in the beginning, we were just hanging out. Next question. <laughs> Never have I ever basically followed your significant other without them knowing. What, did what? Like followed. You're like me without me knowing. Follow without knowing? Yeah. I have not. I've never followed either. Whoa. Well, nah. Oh God, you remember that time where like you was in the house and I was in the house too? Yeah, but that doesn't count. You didn't like follow. I didn't follow you outside. Okay, no, I've never ever done that, y'all. I would never ever invade her privacy like that unless it's for a video because you know we got we got to get the views up so because that's something you do when you don't trust someone and you're trying to like keep like i don't know like catch them doing something i trust my baby and we you know if i didn't trust her then I, I already can let you know anybody who knows me is scared to hang out with her so it is what it is i don't i, I what what, what the whoa no 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 no, no. <laughs> what's understood is what's understood you feel me <laughs> wow. let's go they should be scared, probably. <laughs> All right, never have I ever gotten fired. Never have I ever gotten fired. I have not. I have. Y'all seen the video. It wasn't really fired, but in all other words, it was fired. I was laid off because they got rid of my position, AKA they fired your boy. But uh, that's, that's what brought us to doing this and uh, right. just working on this you entrepreneurial shit thing. You seeing this video right here today mm -hmm. if that didn't happen. Mm -hmm. Y'all already know the answer to this. Whenever have I ever gotten in a fight? I have. I have not. I've gotten a plenty of fights. So You've cool. never ever fought your brother? You never, like what? I've never gotten in like a physical alteration. Me and my brother used to fight, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because I used to I used to come home and I used to, you know what I'm saying? My, my move, my main move, you know what my main move was? <laughs> nah, 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 he do, he do it, he, you know what I'm saying? He be sitting over there talking, I'd be looking at him, you know what I'm saying? Cause I was like, yay hi, and he was like way up here and I would just look at him, right? I'd be like, mm-hmm, you done talking? You done talking? Boom! Right up in there, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> My brother's six years older than me. Boom! What do you mean right he up? He used to get it. What do you it. mean right up in there? Right up in there, dude. You said, oh! I ain't gonna let y'all know what happened afterwards. No, he, actually, he owned up to that. He, you know what? Way to be honest. Honest, honest to the fault. Hey, six-year-old winning. I, I was winning fights, though. You know what I'm saying? Six-year-old going ham. Ham. Never have I ever dropped a piece of candy out of the wrapper on the floor and picked it up and put it in my mouth anyway. Does it have to be candy? Is this candy specific? Did it Five know? second rule, I have. 15 I mean, second yeah. rule, I mean, yeah, 20 I have. second rule. You know what? You know, when you have that little piece that falls down and you watching TV and you forget about it, but then you run out of the package and you over here looking down, you like, oh, I do see one more. And I'm really, really fiending that piece of candy. What you gonna do? Ain't nobody around. You go. You go and pick it up off the ground. You go. <sighs> it also depends. If it's like sticky candy and it drops, and then there's like hair all over it, like it's a no go. You've never taken it, that same piece of candy that had hair and whatever else on it, and rinsed it off in hot water because hot water works. Hot water works, and then still ate it because you rinsed it all off. You know what I'm saying? No. All the sourness is going and all that stuff. Everything no. gone, but hey, no. it still tastes the same. No, if it's like. Stuff stuck to it? Okay, but if I pick it up and there's nothing on it, I'll still eat it. It but tastes the same. If I can visually see stuff, it's a no-go. It's like a hard 100% nah. it, it, ta it tastes the same. Yeah, but you probably get germs. Never have I ever followed through. I, I, I'm on to you. I, I, I'm on to you because I don't know exactly what that means. <laughs> I know. But I got a couple ideas and uh, I'm not going to answer that. Next! You know what I'm saying? I don't even have any ideas. I just completely <laughs> naive to the whole thing. And I think that's pretty much answers them all. That's any, every single any one. Any bonus questions? Anything you want to know? I know everything about you. I don't need any bonus questions. So he's if y'all got any questions and y'all like this video, <laughs> make sure y'all smash that like button, leave y'all comments down below, and the post notification shout out goes to...
Joanna Florence, thank you for being a part of the CE Squad and watching all our videos. If you guys would like a post notification shout out too, because we do them every single video, then click that subscribe button, hit that post notification bell, so you guys will get a chance to get shouted out in our next video, which is uh, going to be tomorrow. So leave your comment down below, done. And until next time, we out.